Well, the Yuma County Health Department expects COVID-19 cases to peak within the next two weeks. Our Aziza Schuler spoke to the chief medical officer at Yuma Regional Medical Center on how they're planning to manage that potential peak. COVID-19 is beginning to hit Yuma Regional Medical Center hard. As more people are testing positive, more people are being admitted into the hospital. Of late Friday, Saturday, we started to see a significant increase uh, in the patients coming to the emergency. Uh, and and uh, we had to transiently use the surge line to keep the capacity. The surge line is a 24 hour direct line to the Arizona Department of Health Services. The line was established at the beginning of the crisis for hospitals across the state to communicate when they're at capacity and need to transfer patients out. Maybe it's a silver lining is that as the rest of the state is, you know, many areas of the state, it's going down uh, the, the incident of the disease. They have more capacities. YRMC reports 60 COVID patients in the hospital as of Tuesday. More than 20 of those patients are in the ICU. To ensure the ICU has capacity for other community patients, the hospital started using this surge line, transferring some patients out to hospitals in Tucson and Maricopa County. Our main issue is ICU nurses. From ADHS, we asked for four nurses and also to respiratory tech technicians. Dr. Magoo says not all of the COVID-19 deaths reported by the county happened at YRMC. Some of Yuma County COVID patients died at hospitals in Tucson. Reporting in Yuma, I'm Aziza Schuler.